All right, Suze, what's happening today? We are at a fantastic event, downtown Sarasota, Dog Oween. Put on through Destinations Downtown, Sarasota. Yes, Destination Downtown Sarasota and the Sarasota Farmers Market. It's Tyler. And Susan Shore. And we are out. And about Sarasota. You know what I say? Let's go on in and take that gander. And who do we have here? Belle, and what is Belle, the princess? Aww. Oh, she's a 50s girl. Alright. Homemade costume judges. What do you think, Tyler? I think it's inspired by Christian Dior. <laughs> <laughs> Very cute. Susan, that kind of looks like your hat. It kind of does. I think we were, you know, we got the same memo. Right. Now, dog number five. Looks like you at night, Sus. It does. Super dog. Who is this? Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. My kind of dog. Whole family. The whole ensemble. So we've got, what do we have going on here? We're beekeepers and these are our bees. Good. Come on, I know. Come on. And we have the German Oktoberfest. Fabulous. So, oh, for the, the dachshund. Fabulous. A kissing booth. Oh my goodness. I must kiss this dog. Tyler, do you think you should give the doggy a kiss? It's I a think kissing. you should. But I don't know. I think you should. Let's see. It looks like my little Louie. Oh. So what was your inspiration? You know, very much. Please pass by the judges. Thank you, Sammy. And now we have number 15. Fabulous. Please pass by the judges. Barely. <laughs> judges. And now we have number 20. Delvis. Delvis. Presley. Okay. Wow. Woo! Oh, look at Wow. <laughs> Heather, what do you think? I think she should have sung it out. She should have sung it out. Okay. Ewok. We've got some Star Wars inspiration going on here. We got Darth Vader. We've got Luke Skywalker. It's like everybody got in on the action. Aubrey, and did you make your costume or did you just put it together? Got a second one. And we have now number 26. Want to have that look no one else has? Check out Soto Optical, 1383 Main Street. So we have our fourth place winner, The Doctor, from Sarasota Memorial Hospital, is that correct? That is correct, yes. Dr. Andy from uh, Sarasota Memorial Hospital. Wow, so Dr. Andy, you're looking really good today. I understand you have a long history of Halloween. What is that? He, uh, this is his second year at this Dogoween event specifically. Uh, last year he was the first place winner um, as a UPS man. Um, Andy's seven years old. We've done Halloween with him every year, a uh, variety of costumes. But uh, yeah, Dr. Andy today and seems to have uh, worked out well. So what are his office hours? You know, he's very selective with his office hours. Um, I'd say, you know, he, he works his nap time into there. So maybe just a few hours a day. Um, but, uh, but yeah, you'll have to probably call his agent to uh, book those. Well, he's looking very good. Congratulations on the great costume. I love it. And I would actually go to see a doctor like this. Oh, me too. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Well, I am here with this fabulous beekeeper and bee family. How are you guys doing today? Great. We're doing really well. I love the costumes. These guys look great. Fantastic. What was your inspiration? You're, they're just sweet as honey? This, him being such a big dog, I thought it'd be cute to put him in something that's not so masculine, you know, something that's just it's a little... hysterical. Yeah, yes. yeah. Fabulous. And then, of course, he followed suit. He just worked right with it, so... That's great. And they don't seem to be that uncomfortable. They're a little antsy. They're looking for some treats, possibly. Oh, oh yeah. I've got a bag full of liver in my pocket. And oh. they've learned that when I put the costumes on, I just give them a whole bunch of treats. And uh -huh. then when I take the costumes off, I stop giving them treats. Uh -huh. So now they're like, all right, we'll put these on. Because we get snacks when we put them on. <laughs> Fantastic. Well, congratulations. Yeah. You guys look great. Thank you Thank you Thank should you. just go out and trick or treat like this. Oh, yeah. That's the plan. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what I thought. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. We are here with Katie and Delvis, the winners of the Dog Oween Downtown 
Doggoween Parade Contest. Congratulations, how does it feel? Thank you, it's always good to be a winner, right? Absolutely, <laughs> and you're- It's really the dog that's it's the winner. It's the dog, he's the winner, he works so hard. I know. I heard he trained for a long time for this. Oh yes, oh yeah. yes, she yeah. she dresses up all the time. Really? Believe it or not, Delvis is a transvestite, I hate to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> Well, he, do, he rocks it well, and I really like the special touch, his eyebrows with the pink. Really well oh, done. Congratulations. Yes. And I love your outfit. I have to tell you, that is fabulous. I am all about the sleeve. I can't believe you said that you got that at a yard sale? Well, it was... Uh, was where was that? Women's Resource Center. They had oh, it on a mannequin, and okay. I said, that is the bomb. Are you selling that? And they were, and it fit me perfectly. So fabulous! The whole ensemble. it started the whole costume because what could I be? I love She's it. She's got to be Elvis to my Priscilla. So where do you go from here? Well, we go up to a music festival called Riverhawk. She's a festival dog, so she's okay. very into the music. Oh. And um, she'll be dressing up there as a can-can girl. She's okay. got a bustier, <laughs> little stuffing going on, and a feather uh, hat so oh she's going to be really cute hopefully you, we'll win again yes oh my god do but you it's the fun you yeah know? do you make all these costumes yourself um i put them together okay. a lot of different things i have made costumes i i i did one that that was like a jester costume that i made out of old felt card table uh uh, tops and uh, had the jingle bells. Those drug. That was for my last dog. This is Ditto because I had a dog named Dallas who oh. did participate in in some of these events years ago. Okay. I've had her for uh, five years. Oh. She's a rescue. She was four four years old when oh, I got her. But um, Dallas won a couple contests. Except those bells will drive them nuts. Yeah. <laughs> well, thank you so much and congratulations thank you. and all the best to you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Wow, Suze, what an incredible day we've had downtown. Oh my God, it was amazing. Doggoween was fabulous. The costumes and everybody got involved. It was so awesome. Destination Sarasota sure knows how to put this thing on. They know how to rock a party and they know how to rock a Doggoween parade. <laughs> <laughs> the creativity from the people that actually got involved. Absolutely. Phenomenal. It was a family event for sure. I and I, the what, kissing booth. The kissing oh, booth. the kissing booth was phenomenal. That was so Absolutely. Cute. And what an awesome honor to be a part of this today. I can't wait for next year for sure. Absolutely. Me too. And I think I'm going to really think out my costume next year. Right, Tyler? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> well, that's going to bring it to a close. And thanks for joining us. We'll see you again when we're out. And about Sarasota. Out and about Sarasota made possible by these sponsors. This has been an Out and About Media Production, a product of Sarasota Socialites.